What's going on everybody? Today we are doing Pro Series Mirage Fafnir. So I finally got Mirage Fafnir in. Um, yeah, let's get right into it. Mirage Fafnir is a left spinning Beyblade. We get the blue and white light launcher for the Pro Series. And yeah, here are your stats. The Everything is the same as far as Takara Tomy. It's just they use a little bit less dense of plastics. And yeah, let's open her up i've already pre-opened her like i said in my the video before my last video um i kind of went through pre-stickered the base and that way we didn't have to do the uh sufferable pre uh the sufferable stickering session of the video i know some people like it but for me that just takes too long so the, the layer's already been pre-stickered i haven't battled it or anything like that as you can tell, there's nothing on the driver, no dings, nothing on the weight. And then I'll show you the layer in a minute. So yeah, we get the light launcher. Then we have our instructions with the QR code. Let me get you that QR code here real quick. So yeah, it just gives you the breakdown of the bay. Here's that QR code to scan in the app. And yeah, here are all of our parts. We'll go over our parts here in a second. So driver, uh, chassis, and our Mirage Fafnir. Getting close, you guys. I only need four more Pro Series bays and Pro Series is done. Um, so yeah, there's our parts. Let me zoom in a little bit more on those. Okay, we are maxed out on that zoom. <laughs> here is Mirage and Fafnir, pretty cool very nice the like i said it's a little less on the rubber and uh but the rubber is still there you can tell that they still used a little bit more on the rubber than their normal hasbro layer because it flexes which is nice um then we have our chassis which is 2s very nice and it is left or right so that is also very nice that you can use it either on a left bay or a right bay and it is a one star very sad then we have our nothing i think this is nothing plus but our nothing driver so let's put this bay together real quick oh yeah and then the stickers are just basically on the fafnir layer we have for his uh chin then the back and then the lower half of the back as well those are the stickers the eye is not a sticker and then how you assemble this bay is you put it just like so the um flat edge at the top of the pointed edge down at the bottom and you just press it together until you hear that click flip it over and there we go she is put together so with that being said let's do a test spin real quick Or not. There we go. Three, two, one. Let her rip. All right. So yeah, Mirage Fafnir. There's not too much to go over here, just because it's you know Fafnir. We all know Fafnir at this point. The rubber king of um, stamina, steel, and slow bursts. So yeah, if you have a Fafnir spinning slower than a normal base, so say you take your Ace Dragon, right? And you launch your Ace Dragon really hard, but you launch your Fafnir at more of a medium, your Fafnir has a chance of bursting, has a higher chance of bursting uh, Dragon just due to the fact that um, the way the bay works. So we have the Pro Series bays right there and let's do some battles. They're all stock form, so don't worry about that. I went, I made, went through and made sure. We'll do Soul Bell Cash. Three, two, one. Oh, that's sad. That is always sad when a bay does that. Okay, putting Soul Bell Cash back together real quick. Okay, let's try this again. Soul Bell Cash. Three, two, one. And Fafnir. Oh, 
Oh, shoot, you guys. Sorry about that. There we go. And then I'll move the stadium here in just one second. Sold Bell Cash with a win. Very nice. We'll do it again. Just because the launch angle for that camera was really bad. Three, two, one. <sighs> Yet again. Okay, put it back together. Three, two, one. There we go. We might just use a normal dual threat launcher for this. Maybe we'll have to wait and see what happens. Three, two, one. Okay, Mirage Faulkner gets a ring out finish that time. Oh yeah, so we already have some uh, some wear damage. There we go. Yeah, like I said, lighter on the, they use a lot less dense of a plastic than um, Takara Tomy does. <sighs> really? Three, two, one. Fafnir takes the first win. Next up, we'll do another left spin. Let's do, I gotta look for it real quick. Ah, here we go. Wizard Fafnir facing off against Mirage Fafnir. This should be fun. Three, two, one. Sorry, I had to fix Mirage. Mirage kind of, doesn't sit right, so there's something. Let it rip. All right, the two Faulkners are facing off. All right, Mirage gets the first win. Three, two, one. Now Vanish did get launched a little bit slower, but Vanish should still win, which it does. I mean, Mirage, not Vanish. Vanish is a pro series. I mean, not pro series, Dynamite. All right, so Mirage wins again. Now then we will do left spin with Master Devilos. And we're doing the stamina tip first, three, two, one. Well, you guys get to see Master Double O spin and left spin for a second. All right, try this again. Three, two, one. Okay. And then we'll switch over and do Master Double O. So after we do the other two tips, we'll switch it over and do right spin. Master Devilos still getting a win there. Very nice. We'll do the attack tip next. Three, two, one. Fafnir just coming back for more. Can it do a spin steal though? That's what I'm wondering. Oh, no, it doesn't. It does not. All right. Reset Faulkner real quick. Now we will do the defense tip. Three, two, one. I knew that was going to happen eventually. Yeah, no, definitely weird. Fafnir doesn't, teeth, Fafnir's teeth don't click. And it reminds me a lot of a fake bay. Ooh, nothing, nothing to break. 
happened there for a second. Okay, very nice. Now then we will put it, we'll do right spin Devilos here in a minute. Oh, Master Devilos. Next up is Zone, uh, Zwei Luenor, three, two, one. Very nice. We will go the next up, which is the defense mode. come back out of the pocket only for the zone Luinor to lose now we're doing the attack tip yeah so listen very closely so i'm going to show you so right here here's the teeth and then so yeah it just oh it does it's made very weird like i don't like how it's made um it feels it feels just like if you were to put a fake Beyblade together. It doesn't feel Takara ish All right. Oh, we're doing the attack tip. That's right. Ooh, very nice. Good hit, but is not enough. All right. Now we're doing tact with trans and cross. Okay. Three, two, one. Try this again real quick. Three, two, one. Luenor, I mean, Fafnir takes the first round. Now we will do the other version for tact. I mean, not tact, uh, trans. Three, two, one. Tact Luenor has got to be one of my favorite just GT maids in general that was released for the GT series. Mirage wins again. All right, now we are doing right spin bays. Right spin. All right. Oh yeah, it didn't set up. We're gonna do Devilos now, Master Devilos. Let me set up Master Devilos real quick. Master Devilos is so easy to set up. I love it. All right. Master Devilos and defense tip versing Mirage Fafnir. Three, two, one. Ooh, very nice. Master Devilos recovered. I was about to call the match there. Mirage taking the first round. All right, moving on to the stamina tip. Three, two, one. That always happens without fail. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. All right. There we go, three, two, one. You gotta be kidding me. Oh, launcher jammed, and Fafnir is stuck on the launcher, you guys.
Okay, so that launcher is out of commission. So let's try it again on a different launcher. All right. Oh, if I could drop F-bombs. Three, two, one. Very nice. While that match is going, let's see if I can fix that launcher. Oh, you know what? I have another light launcher right here. We'll just do the light launchers, you guys. Not as much power, but at least. All right. Now then, the final tip is the attack tip. But at least we should be able to get things moving along. Three, two. Three, two, one. You got to be freaking kidding me. Okay, that's a miss. That's a relaunch. This is what holds up these videos, man. Just the amount of mislaunching. Let it rip. Let it rip. There we go. Who's it gonna be? Mirage Fafnir with another win. Very nice. Mirage is actually doing pretty good, you guys. All right. Next up will be Judgment Joker with Ultimate Reboot, Glaive, and Zero. Three, two, one. hits good hits all the way around you guys oh judgment joker almost had it almost got it with ring out finish fafner holding on though fafner taking a loss in the first round that was good that was honestly really good all right reset fafner real quick and then get judgment joker going and three two one Judgment Joker trying to burst Fafnir getting those heavy hits in. Fafnir again with a win. That is six wins, you guys. Six wins. We'll do Orb and Guard next. It's kind of a shame, though, that they don't have a QR code for this left launcher. That would be nice. Because earlier in the early release of Pro Series, the launchers had QR codes, but when they got to the second release, the launcher stopped having QR codes for him, and we never got a QR code for the left launcher. Three, two, one. Very interesting combo with Orb Vanguard having Sting. Now we'll just do one shots until we get to some more gimmick bays. All right. Another victory for Fafnir. Prime Apocalypse with zero uh, dagger and ultimate reboot. It's stock combo. Three, two, one. Well, that didn't work. Fafnir fell off the, the dang launcher curve that launcher the launcher blades in a little bit so that way the base stop falling off the launchers there we go three two one oh both base almost got simultaneously rang out but they hop back in who's it gonna be mirage fafnir that is eight wins you guys holy crap Sword Valkyrie, or, uh, yeah, Sword Val Valtriac. All right. Three, two, one. And of 
course, I say, and I'm pressing in the dang launcher teeth, but Sword Valkyrie decides to uh, fall off. All right, three, two, one. We'll do another Valkyrie next. We'll do Chosey Blue. We'll go through the Valkyries, why not? Yeah, Fafnir. All right, Chosey Valkyrie now. And Chosey Valkyrie has um, Blitz and I think, sp yeah, Spiral with the rubber tip. Blitz and Spiral. All right, three, two, one. cannot escape the pocket very sad very sad indeed i tried to go for more of an angled launch but it just didn't work we'll go one more round with that one just because spiral is kind of a hard uh tip to use three two one there we go that's what i wanted You know, I was talking crap about the, the light launchers, but you can actually get some decent power out of them. And we got a draw. One win, one draw. So, uh, Fafnir does take a win on that one. All right. Definitely got some good hard hits out of that battle, though. Now we have the last Chosey with um, Destroy. Is that Destroy? Yeah, destroy. Um, and then we have the Zeta Disc and the Crimson Lair for Chosey Valkyrie. For three, two, one. Well, Valkyrie. Oh, Thrones! Valkyrie! Immediate. Well, Valkyrie. I'm just. I'm going to call in their Takara Tomy counterpart names um, just because it is Pro Series. And I know that's not correct, grammatically correct, but it's Pro Series. All right, so Fafnir throws Valkyrie into the pocket and is not able to escape. Moving on, we will do the other Devilos. We have Venom Devilos with um, Omega and Ultimate Reboot. I mean, re Variable Dash. Ultimate Reboot, Variable Dash. All right, three, two, one. open there yeah that's another one that's hard to hard to utilize because it just if you don't get the launch angle right it just goes straight into the pocket all right three two one ah damn it gotta depress gotta press in those teeth again for the launcher because they just keep wanting to fall off the stupid launcher Okay, hey, we're not doing too bad though. 23 minutes, we, we're about halfway through the Pro Series collection. We still got four, I still have four more I need to purchase and then we're done, which are the Twins and um, Infinite Achilles and Brave Valkyrie and then we're done with Pro Series. I do plan on getting those, but it'll be a little bit of a, a little bit of a grind. We're waiting, I, oh dang. We are waiting on Rage Luminor to come in. Um, it should ship out the 1st of December. It is a little bit of a wait for that one. Very nice. Fafnir with a win. All right, I am thinking now let's do Knockout Odax. Odin, three, two, one. This is another one, yeah. Let it rip. Yeah, Odin is a knockout Odin because it has um, Octa is a really hard bay to keep stable in the stadium because it just jumps around. It's like dealing with Heat Salaman uh, Hell Salamander again. Come on. All right, three, two, one.
But it is good because it's hard to get it in those pockets, though. Knockout Odin. Very nice with a win. Our first loss is Knockout Odin. One of the worst Pro Series bays gets a win. How about that? Almost a burst. Um, Let's do Command Dragon. Three, two, one. Tried to pull off a Kai move there. Ooh, Fafnir's getting more spin though. Look at that. Oh, we got a draw. Fafnir got more spin off of that. That was pretty nice. If Fafnir had evaded a little bit, used a little bit more evasion, it would have won. Surprising there. Three, two, one. Moves from one pocket to the other. All right, Fafnir with a win. Okay, next up we'll do the other dragon, Ace Dragon with Reboot and Drake. Other than that, the lair is stock. No, the lair is not stock. They use the command dragon chip. All right. Three, two, one. And Dragon immediately gets tossed into the pocket. Let Fafnir spin there real quick while I reset these launchers. So one loss, not not too terrible. One complete total loss. Um, let's do Harmony Pegasus or Heaven Pegasus. The only difference between the with Heaven Pegasus is it has um, Eternal. I think it's Eternal for the uh, chassis, not the chassis, the frame, and then it has Revolve for the um, for the uh, tip. All right, three, two, one. Both staminas. Who is the better stamina? Now remember, Harmony Pegasus is actually pretty decent with this combo. Fafnir, barely, barely Fafnir. It's another win for Fafnir. One win, I mean one loss, and we are sitting at fifteen wins. That's some pretty good odds. Next up, we'll do Phoenix. Perfect Phoenix. Three, two, one. Perfect Phoenix quickly gets knocked into that pocket by Mirage. Mirage did get knocked into the pocket, but nothing did save it, and it bounced out. So very nice. Would the armor have come off? No, the armor wouldn't have even came off. Crazy. That was a quick batch. That's 16 wins. All right, we'll do the Achilles next. We have Black Chosey with... Um, why can't I remember this driver's name? But yeah, we have this driver and then um, one for the um, disc. All right. Three, two, one. Like I said, the whole reason why these videos get held up, I think that's my biggest gripe with Pro Series is Pro Series just does not like to stay on any launcher. Three, two, one. Well, that was a crapshoot of a match. We'll go one more time on this match just because I would like to see what happens. Black Chosey Achilles for Pro Series gets burst pretty often. So I'd like to see if, ha if Faulkner can claim a burst. Three, two, one.
Oh, our second loss goes to is from Black Chosy Achilles. And the swords, the, the burst stopper swords, didn't even get pushed in. Crazy. Next up, we will go regular Chosy Achilles, but we will have the um driver all the way down. Okay, and three, two, one. Looked like Mirage Fafnir. All right, then we will go to its mid-height. Three, two, one. Three, two, one. Very nice, Mirage Fafnir again, this time with a ring out finish. And you got to see uh, nothing, is it nothing crash or nothing break? Nothing break, because the other one is crash for, um, for uh, Chosey it's crash. All right, max height. And the swords got pushed in that time too, so that's pretty cool. All right, three, two, one. Dimension's not a bad tip. It's really not, but it just, I don't know. It lacks in, it's more attack based than stamina based. We got another win, almost up to 18 wins, you guys. Almost to 18 wins. This is gonna be another long match. We have stock form Union Achilles with Extend Plus, Change, and as you all know, Change has a gimmick to where you push the top layer up and then you turn it to the other side to make it more balanced. So we'll do the more balanced version of change real quick, starting off with the stamina tip. Okay. Can we get our 18th win? Three, two, one. Very nice. Very nice on Fafnir's part. Okay. Now then we'll do the defense tip. I don't think we'll go through all the modes for Achilles because that'll be too long. We'll just do it how it is. All right, three, two, one. And then I have it in defense. Mirage again, and I lied. Well, uh, cause we're doing the attack tip next. We're gonna take change and make it lopsided so we can do the attack, the full on attack for Union. I think, I think the one thing I still hate about Union is we should have had rubber swords and then metal swords. Um, I feel like if we had metal blades and then rubber blades, that would have been pretty cool. Um, just because of the fact like we could have used now that it's fully on attack mode, you know, we could have had metal blades to use on full attack and it, like make it really heavy for that attack to get that burst. But they just, I don't know, it's something they didn't think about. All right. Three, two, one. Ooh, both bays get knocked in the pocket twice. And Mirage Fafnir wins again. 18 wins. 
18 wins, two losses. Pretty crazy stuff. We'll do um, first uh, Uranus. All right. Three, two, one. Not too bad, 36 minutes and we have four bays left. Four bays left, you guys, and 36 minutes. Very nice, Fafnir again, making it its 19th win. Um, We will do Hyperion next, Black Hyperion. Okay, three, two, one. Ooh, heavy, heavy hits. Getting into some of them Chosey battles now. And Fafnir, barely, but still Fafnir. That makes 20 wins. 20 wins, you guys. Next up, we will do Variant Lucy, uh, Lucifer in its stock mode. All right, Variant Lucifer facing off against Fafnir. Three, two, one. This one should be interesting. They both have rubber. They both don't really hit that hard. I, I think Lucifer might actually win this one. Because as you all know, Lucifer is probably the worst Pro Series Beyblade ever made. Yep, I called it. Our third loss goes to variant Lucifer. Interesting. Now we have the gold variant Lucifer with Atomic. Atomic's probably, like I said, Atomic and Metal Atomic are my favorite two tips of all time. Just really versatile tips. Three, two, one. Very versatile and very stable. Especially when you start to use Metal Atomic. Like, hands down, one of my favorite combos is Metal Atomic. Um, Metal Atomic Prime Apocalypse. And then you throw something like... Omega. You throw something like Omega on Prime Apocalypse with Metal Atomic, just instant wins, constantly, back to back. All right, our 21st win, and our last bay, we have um, Lord Spryzen. I think we're starting off in Right Spin for Lord Spryzen. Yes, we are. Right Spin, Lord Spryzen. This one should be an interesting match, too. Three, two, one. Wow, okay. Let's uh, redo that. Come back here, Lord Spryzen. Three, two, one. Really? Push those teeth in yet again. I swear, man, I swear. Three, two, one. Ooh. Solid hits. Solid big hit right at the beginning of the match. Press those teeth in real quick for that launcher to keep the launcher from stalling. And Fafnir with a win. Now we switch. Um, Lord Spryzen to left spin. Left spin, Lord Spryzen. And we get ready to wrap this video up. Just making sure, there we go. Three, two, one. And
And Fafnir with another win. Very nice. So total, Fafnir won pretty often, you guys. Like, pretty good. Like, on Fafnir's odds, it did surprisingly really well. Twenty-three wins, three losses is a pretty good. <laughs> that's pretty good odds. So just to show you what I was talking about, probably one of my favorite combos is this combo right here with uh, Omega, Eternal, and Prime Apocalypse. Now you want to use the metal, the metal, um, like metal um, atomic is really really good for this combo. All right. Three, two, one. Yeah, and Apocalypse wins. Now then, if we wanted to switch it up, you can use something a little like Eternal to make it a little bit heavier. I mean, Omega, which we would use, you know, the around disc, put it on Prime Apocalypse, and, you know, you still get a little bit more of a heavy bay to keep it more grounded. So now then Prime Apocalypse with around and, um, God, why can't, uh, around atomic. Three, two, one. Like I said, just, you put something decent on atomic, it just, it destroys. It destroys everything. Like, atomic was just such an underused driver. Sorry, we're going a little bit extra. I guess this could be considered bonus content, but we got 43 minutes on the video now. And Apocalypse wins. Like I said, such a good driver. And a lot of people gave Atomic a lot of crap for some reason. And I'm like, why? Atomic is such a good driver. Like, I, I'm sorry. I It's one of my favorite drivers. Other than, um, other than Revolve, Atomic is easily one of my favorite drivers of all time. It's so simple and so effective. And it's better than Yard. I will say it, it's better than Yard. Because Yard had a bear, uh, had a little BB in it too, but it just, it wasn't as good. Now, when you get to the, uh, the Slingshot version of Yard, yeah, Slingshot Yard is phenomenal. All right. So yeah, this is going to wrap up this video on Mirage Fafnir. Now, my thoughts, definitely get it. It is an amazing bay. It's right next to, I put it in A tier. A tier or even S tier as far as, uh, Pro Series goes. Um, I know that's different to compared to a lot of other videos, but just how it is, you saw firsthand that it destroyed literally almost all of the competition other than three bays. So 22, 23 wins and three losses is really good. It's right up there with Harmony Pegasus. Uh, the only reason why Harmony Pegasus, it's just so good. It just, the only thing it was missing is this should have been a dash driver and Harmony Pegasus. Pfft, game over, you guys. If Harmony Pegasus had a dash revolve driver, that would have been game over. But yeah, so Mirage Fafnir. My thoughts, completely great. I love this bay, you guys. It's probably one of one of the few Pro Series bays that have come out in a long while that I actually truly enjoyed. It's just phenomenal. You can't get around that. Um, and the fact that it was stock too, that's another thing that we got stock Mirage Fafnir. And with that being said, you guys, well, guess what? With Vanish Fafnir, well, Mirage Fafnir in the mix, we now have completed the Fafnir collection. Look at that. Every single Hasbro Fafnir Bay right there. We have Drain Fafnirs. Then we have the two Geist Fafnirs, the two, um, Wizard Fafnir's, then we have our Zone Fafnir, 
Then we have our two um, Mirage Fafnirs that we just did one of them went on a video. And then we have our other Fafnir releases for Speedstorm and then our three Quad Drive Fafnir releases. So honestly, you guys, this was such a fun collection to do. Um, if you haven't, definitely get all of them. They're pretty cool looking bays. Colossal Fafnir is just redonkulous. That's all I'm going to say on that. Um, but yeah, the, the, just such a, it was such a fun collection to go through and do. Very sweating at this point to do. I will let you know that because this bay right here, extremely hard to get. This bay right here, extremely hard to get. And then just any of the drain Fafnirs, good luck. Um, if you're able to do it and you see them, go after it because it's just going to get harder over the times to do. Um, I will do a Fafnir collection video at some point, but I got other stuff I got to wrap up on. So in the meantime, um, just be patient. We will be doing, we got another micro in this box right here. So we will be doing a micro bay video today, same day, guaranteed. All right, guys. But for the meantime, hey, thank you for the likes, comments, and subscribes. We just pushed another, we're like 20 subscribers away from 900 subscribers, I think. So thank you guys so very much for grinding the effort and, you know, for the amazing comments and everything. And, you know, whenever you guys correct me when I'm wrong, it's nice because I want to make sure that the content is correct. Um, so thank you for that. And as always, three, two, one, let it rip. Have a great day, everyone.